Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jay. If you've been watching my channel recently, you may have seen one or both of my videos talking about our broken food system, um, the words organic and natural and how they're being misused, the pesticides and herbicides being used on our food and things like that. I won't get into all of it here. Um, if you're interested, I'll have both of those videos linked down below in the description. I really encourage you to give them a watch if you wanna become educated on what's on and in your food and some things that you can do about it. So the second video is really focused on companies and brands that I trust to purchase food items from and that's wonderful. There were only a few, but it's really important to me now that I've opened so many people's eyes to the issues that we're facing that I continue to give you solutions. It's not fair for me to just say, hey, here's all of the problems we're facing without also offering you some solutions. I wanna start by saying I am not sponsored by Thrive Market. It is just another option that I, as a consumer, have explored myself. Everything that I'm gonna show you, I paid for myself out of my own pocket. I Maybe someday I will be sponsored by them. I think that that would be fantastic. That's definitely a company that I align with and would be honored to be sponsored by. But in this video, I am not. I'm just going to talk to you about them and I don't think this is even gonna be a very long video. Just letting you know that this is an option. And there are many other options, but this is one. Thrive Market is a uh, membership-based company, just like BJ's, Costco, Sam's Club, and stores like that. You pay a membership to shop with them. I just, uh, it is December 2022. I just signed up a couple days ago, and I paid, I've got it pulled up, $64.75 year, an annual membership. So that's what I paid to have a year with them. You can cancel at any time. You can, you can order at any time. So when you put in your first order, um, that's not saying that you can only put in one order a month, you can put in as many orders as you want. So I did my first order and I really was very methodical in choosing these items because I wanna kind of talk to you about what my thought process was when I chose these items. So let's go ahead and break into this baby. I did not purchase any frozen or items that need to be kept cold because this was free shipping, but if you order um, frozen or items that need to be kept cold, you either have to spend $120 on those items or you do have to pay for shipping. And it's right before Christmas that I'm putting this together and, and filming this and I did not have the extra money to do that. So maybe another time I'll film one of those. This is all shelf stable items that we're gonna go over right now. So first things first, and maybe I'll be able to um, talk about all of these things together. I did buy parchment baking sheets. They are compostable, certified, unbleached, totally chlorine-free parchment paper baking sheets. I did not realize how many chemicals are in parchment paper. They seem incredibly unnecessary. There are certain preservatives and chemicals that are in the items in our homes and items that we eat that are necessary. They serve a purpose and are more justifiable in my mind. But if these work just as good, then the chlorine and the bleach seem completely unnecessary in conventional parchment paper. So I'm really excited to give these a try. Um, stay tuned. If, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do a lot of baking around here, so you'll probably see these get used here soon. Next, I got this Better Life brand all-purpose cleaner, Clary Sage and Citrus. It's got plant-derived cleaning agents, no alcohol, no petroleum solvents, no synthetic fragrances, no dyes, no parabens, no SLS or SLES, made in the USA with select uh, parts and ingredients from around the world, cruelty-free. So my whole purpose with this was just to find um, an all-purpose cleaner that is less harsh and not um, artificially fragranced because it's, I don't think fragrances are necessary personally and I'm trying to get away from them. And currently, I use bleach. I have a bleach spray that I use on all of my surfaces, including my kitchen counter where I roll out bread dough and make all number of things. So I definitely, definitely wanted to switch to a better all-purpose cleaner that is not as harsh as bleach, which was gonna be easy to do because bleach is very harsh. So I ended up going with this one. I did get the big one. Um, I haven't tried it, but I feel like I'll like it, so I went for it. 
I also ended up getting um, Dr. Bronner's Sale Suds Biodegradable Cleaner. And I'm trying to, I don't remember, I read all about these when I uh, purchased them, but it was a couple days ago. You can use this for a lot of different things. You can use it as an all-purpose cleaning spray. You can use it for laundry, dishes, mopping. You can use it to clean the car, patio furniture, and other large jobs. You can use it to clean fruits and veggies. And you can also use it to clean carpets, stone, wood, glass, and stainless steel. So this is another really all-purpose cleaner, but this is a concentrate. So you wouldn't need to use this directly on anything. You would dilute it with another ingredient such as water. So I thought that this sounded really good. It had awesome reviews. It had reviews from people who were saying they've been using it for decades and really liked it and that they have not changed their um, recipe, I guess, ingredients in, in ever. So I'm really excited to use this and it sounds like people really enjoy it. So I did get that. Next up, I'm glad that they put all of this stuff together. It's easy to go through. I also got Dr. Bronner's 4-in-1 Baby Unscented Organic Sugar Soap for face, body, hair, and hands made with fair trade ingredients. I'm trying to find, I purposely picked unscented. Like I said, I'm trying to get away from um, fragrances. They're unnecessary. Um, and I'm, I'm planning on using this as a hand soap. I have, I like to put a hand soap out in the downstairs bathroom. Well, I obviously have hand soap in all of the bathrooms, but I wash my hands mostly in the downstairs bathroom. So that's what I purchased this for. If I like it, I will then purchase one for the kitchen and the upstairs bathroom as well. So hopefully I like it. Um, I, def I wanted to try this one, whereas these I think will be fine but we wash our hands dozens of times a day. So this matters to me a little bit more, especially with it being the winter time. Um, if it you know, makes my hands really dry or whatever. Um, so I wanted to try this one. And I also got the all-in-one all Hemp Baby Unscented Pure Castile Bar Soap. Certified fair trade, made with organic oils, also Dr. Bronner's. I'm planning on using this one as a body soap. That was what I wanted to do. I love the idea of getting away from plastics if I can help it. So I'm throwing it back and I'm gonna try using a bar soap for my um, body soap in the shower. And we'll see, we'll see how I like it. So I'm excited about that. And I think I'm pretty sure this is my last household item. Let me see. Oh yeah. I think. Um, I got Dr. Bronner's Peppermint All-in-One Toothpaste. Fluoride-free, 70% organic ingredients, helps freshen breath, whiten teeth, reduce plaque. Um, no artificial preservatives, no artificial colors, no artificial flavors, no artificial sweeteners, no synthetic detergent foaming agents, fluoride-free, low foaming, 100% vegan, no animal byproducts or testing, and yeah. Um, I, this one had, um, a lot of reviews, not all of them were positive, but it was all very opinion based. Um, somebody said they didn't like it because it didn't foam up as much as the regular toothpaste. Somebody else said they didn't like the taste. Those are all opinion based things. And also you have to keep in mind that when you're switching from conventional to organic or natural, um, you're often going to have to accept that it's gonna be a little different from what you're used to. The conventional is the way it is because of all of those added things that make it more pleasant um, or palatable or what have you. So I'm okay with the fact that this may not foam up as much, may not taste as fresh, whatever. Um, I love that it's fluoride free and that was really my motivation behind trying out a Dr. Bronner toothpaste. So I'm gonna give it a shot. We'll see how it goes, and I will let you guys know what I think. Um, moving on to food now. Late July are my favorite organic uh, tortilla chip, and I eat a lot of tortilla chips because I have a lot of salsa that I've canned up, and I decided to get these because um, at my grocery store, they are, I wanna say, for some reason, $4.67 is standing out to me but that's a really random number. I know it was four something, $4 and something cents. And through 
Thrive Market, they were $3.32. And that's the thing about Thrive Market is that these products are more affordable than you'll find them anywhere else through Thrive Market. That's what makes the membership worth it. And they also have a price matched guarantee. So if you find a product cheaper somewhere else, they will price match it for you. So I mean, you can definitely get these products cheaper through Thrive Market or at least the same price. And I think that that's really great. So as soon as I saw that these were cheaper, I was like, oh yeah, gonna get them through Thrive Market from now on. So that's what, that's why I have these. Same with the organic Cheddar Buddy Bunnies, um, 12 pouches. I just bought these the other day from my local grocery store and they were $8 and they're $6.64 through Thrive Market. So that was a great savings. And if you, just these two items alone, if I purchase them, you know, a couple times a month, every month for a year, I've already racked up just in these two items, these two pantry items, I've racked up quite a bit of savings. So already in just my first purchase, I'm seeing that this membership through Thrive Market is really gonna be worth it. So I'm trying to find more organic snacky things because Tom and I are both snacky people and that's really where you lose it is, um, snacks because they're just so hard to find organic. So I did decide to try these dried organic um, pineapple pieces. I love pineapple and I do have a dehydrator, but it's not something that I am really interested in doing if I'm being honest with you. And these were, I'm gonna go over the prices of everything at the end, but these were $7.64 for a six ounce pouch. So maybe it'll be worth at some point going through and dehydrating my own but for now just so i can get a, an organic snack i'm excited to have these and i think they'll be really good next i have this cast iron brush and scraper um, i haven't made a video on it yet but i am going to tackle cookware and a lot of the toxins that we are consuming through our cookware and so um, i've already switched fully over to glass and cast iron. I'm exclusively using glass and cast iron from now on. And so I wanted with as often as I'm now using my cast iron, I wanted a really nice cast iron brush that I can use to keep it clean and in good working order. So this one is bamboo handle with non-toxic coating, certified recycled plastic head and plastic free packaging. It safely cleans cast iron without removing seasoning. So I'm excited to have this and this will allow me to keep my cast iron clean and in good working order. So I'm excited about that. Another item that I just kind of bought on a whim, but I'm really glad that I'll, I finally have is a drinking straw brush. Um, I do use a lot of um, reusable drinking cups and whatnot. Some of them do have straws and sometimes it concerns me. I worry that they're not, the straws aren't fully getting clean. And so I've been actually needing to get one. I was just having a conversation with my coworker about this a couple weeks ago and they had this for, I think $3. So I said, yes, please. Cause I need to go through and clean all of my straws. Okay, that was everything that I ordered. However, when I signed up and paid for the membership, they allowed me with my first order to choose a gift package. And there were four or five to choose from and I ended up choosing this one and they sent me a bunch of free items. So now I'm gonna go through those with you. I did not choose these, they sent these to me for free. So I have a Thrive Market Healthy Living Made Easy Cookbook. They sent me organic, gluten-free farfalle pasta. They also sent me um, almond butter, creamy almond butter. So it's not organic, I'm noticing. Non-GMO, plant-based, gluten-free, no added sugars or sweeteners. So I'll take that. Not organic, but it was free. So we're gonna eat it. <laughs> and at least it's um, non-GMO. And then lastly, they sent me, this is nice, ghee. Ghee is clarified butter, Himalayan pink salt, grass-fed ghee. Fourth and Heart is the brand, non-GMO, certified, let's see. Ghee is a lactose-free superfood alternative to other everyday butter butter alternatives and cooking oils that is made by simply cooking and filtering butter. Made from milk from cows not treated with RBST, the hormones, and it says pasture raised. 
I'll be honest with you, I would not purchase this on my own because it does not say organic and it does not say certified grass-fed either. So even though it says pasture raised, keep in mind that that's a buzz phrase and unless there is some kind of certification to back it up, it doesn't actually mean anything. So I don't know that I would have purchased this on my own just because of the lack of labeling, but again, it was free, so I'm probably gonna use it. And I've never used ghee before. I know what it is, but I've never used it. So that's cool that they sent me some free items just for signing up. Um, and I'm excited to try them, especially, especially the pasta and the cookbook. I think that's really cool. I do wanna go over with you quickly the prices that I paid for everything, just so you can get an idea of the costs shopping through Thrive Market. For the late July um, organic tortilla chips, $3.32. For the Annie's Organic Cheddar Bunny Cracker Snack Pack, 12 bags for $6.64. The all-purpose cleaner, um, the spray bottle one, 32-ounce spray bottle for $5.84. The cast iron scrub brush was $7.19. The compostable unbleached parchment baking sheets, it's a 24 count of pre-cut. They did also have the roll that does not come pre-cut. Um, the price difference wasn't that much, so I went ahead with the pre-cut ones, $4.79. Organic dried pineapple, six ounce pouch, $7.64. The 12 uh, ounce bottle of liquid pump soap, Dr. Bronner's was $8.36. That's part of the reason I only bought one because I thought that was actually kind of expensive, but if I like it, I'm willing to pay it. So we'll see. The bar soap, Dr. Bronner's was $3.86 for a five ounce bar. The Sal Suds Biodegradable Cleaner, 32 fluid ounce bottle was $11.69. Keep in mind that that's a concentrate. So that bottle's gonna go a long way. The five ounce toothpaste, Dr. Bronner's was $5.21, which is a little expensive. But again, when you are choosing um, organic and you're choosing to go the route where it, it is missing all of those toxins and, and preservatives and chemicals and whatnot, you are gonna pay a little bit more often, but it's, it's worth it if you ask me. And that's a decision that you have to make for yourself and your household. And then the drinking straw brush was $3.29. My total was $80, but they do give you the opportunity to donate to um, a charity when you're checking out. So I rounded it up and paid $6.10. So my order before that was, uh, la, 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 la. oh, I'm not doing that math. It doesn't break it down for me. And that was a $60 cooking staple set that they sent me for free. So that's cool. So I really do feel that this membership will pay for itself throughout the course of a year based on the items that I'm purchasing. There are many other items that I want to try through Thrive Market, but again, it's Christmas in a few days and I really had to take it easy. I wanted to have enough to um, have a video for you guys. And I also genuinely want to switch out things like my my baking items and my hand soap, my cleaning supplies. Um, I wanted that brush that was probably a one-time purchase so that I can care for my cast iron. The things like the crackers and the chips are items that I'm already buying for more money. You know what? I wonder if I have a code. Do that don't they just send everybody codes? I feel like like refer a friend. Okay, yeah, I have a referral link. <laughs> Can you tell that I am, have never had any sponsors <laughs> before? Um, and this isn't one. I, I'm not good at this. But I have a referral link that I will post um, down in the description. And it says, um, give your friend 40% off their first order and you'll earn $40 Thrive Cash when your friend becomes a member. So if you are interested in becoming a Thrive member, a Thrive Market member, then please use the code down in the description when you sign up. It helps you and it helps me, which helps my channel. So anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or any comments, leave them down in the comment section for me. If you already use Thrive Market, let me know what you think. If you want to further discuss this, leave a comment and I'll chat with you about it if you have any questions, like I said. And um, yeah, so I'll see you guys in my next video. Be blessed, my friends.